song. It's a quarter to eight on ABC Sunshine Coast. Whatever you're up to, I hope you're having a great start to your day. You're with Emma Silicons on ABC Sunshine Coast. Well, are you a fan of jazz? It don't mean a thing if it ain't got that swing. Do I 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 The greats like the lovely Ella Fitzgerald. Well, if it's your thing, you are in luck because you have your chance to get a taste of jazz here at the Sunshine Coast this weekend with local jazz singer Robin Brown. She's bringing her show Mood Indigo, Songs of the Blues Side of Jazz, to the Jazz and Blues Collective this Sunday. And what you'll get to experience is, as I understand it, a pretty extensive repertoire. But today on ABC Sunshine Coast, Robin has brought along her band, or at least part of her band, to give you a little bit of a taste of what you can expect. Uh, Robin and co, good morning. Hello. Good morning. So tell me, um, people can't really see what's going on here, but it's not just you with a microphone. There's a lot going on in the studio right now. What's around us? What's going on with all these instruments? Scottish dancers, tap dancers. <laughs> no, we have uh, Peter Walters here on, on bass. He's got brought his bass in. We also have Ross Nixon, the amazing Ross Nixon on piano, We're filling up the studio with a piano. Yes, it's pretty large. I'm not going to lie. Um, yeah, I don't know if we've ever set up this much, or at least I haven't, in the studio. So can you tell me a little bit about what we can expect of Sunday of the show? Well, we've got a five-piece band, actually, so it'll be a lot of fun. But we're doing a, this show particularly, I'm doing a bit of a theme with songs from the blues side of jazz. So I talk, I have a lot of interest in a lot of the history of where songs have come from and uh, how they've developed. So telling some of the stories and some of the early blues right from the 19, I think the earlier songs, 1918, right through to songs that have even from Vince Jones right from the 1990s, sorry, 2000. <laughs> and 10 is his like, most recent song. Yeah, so we're doing a lot of beautiful swing songs, blues songs, and, and some of the stories behind them. Oh, it sounds like a lot of fun. What are your favorite things to play or to sing? Me, well, some of these, I, my, I love jazz. I love a lot of the jazz, um, but I love a lot of the passion that's in gospel and blues. So I connect with that a lot. Mm. Yes. Have you got a favourite? Could you mention one or two? I know oh it's hard, my goodness! But you love yeah, it all. It's so hard. What's your f most favourite? Oh, There's got to be something that you just love yeah. getting up there, and you're like, "This is my song. The stage <laughs> is mine." Yes. Which Quite one a few is it? The one I often go to is "Just Squeeze Me," which is an Ella Fitzgerald tune. I do mm. that a lot. Oh, gosh, there's too many. I'm always okay. learning new songs. I'll be happy with just that one because you're going to perform um, the likes of Ella Fitzgerald. Uh, are you doing some Sarah Vaughan and Bessie Smith, Smith as well? Yes. Okay. Bessie Smith's very early blues singer, yeah. from the, one of the first recording artists from the early 1920s. Oh, wow. I feel like I should be wearing my flapper outfit for the early <laughs> 1920s. Yes. I'm wearing the wrong attire on ABC Sunshine Coast. Chatting to Robin Brown and her lovely band who are here at the Sunshine Coast. They will be performing this Sunday at the Jazz and Blues Collective. And if you're into your jazz, it sounds like this is right up your alley. You weren't always a jazz singer, though, were you? No, I've come into it a bit later in life. Okay, how much yeah. later? When did you get into jazz? Oh, in my 40s. Wow. <laughs> oh, my goodness. How, yes. how did that happen? Oh, gosh, it's a bit of a long journey. So I um, have a disabled son, so I wasn't able to do a lot because I have very full-on life caring for him. Mm -hmm. But I lo started listening to jazz. I first... Um, artist I think that caught my ear was Natalie Cole started listening to her and right. Harry, Harry Connick Jr and grew from there and then uh, came to the coast and there was her Sunshine Coast Blues Club and I went in and sang some early Billy Holiday uh, that type blues and it kind of just kept growing from there wow. and um, yeah so in, in uh, some workshops at Brisbane Jazz Club and performing and so yeah it's been a Fun journey. And now you perform professionally. You've cut some albums as well. Like yes. you've done a lot. Three. <laughs> yes. Wow. Performed in Prague, five different jazz so clubs did, in Prague and Paris. Did you think Paris. like 10 years ago, 15 no. years ago that you would be doing no, this? No, never imagined any of this. It's wonderful. Wow. Um, I also hear you organise a regular jazz event at the Sunshine Coast called the Jazz Sessions. The what's Jazz that? Sessions. Yeah, I've been organising that, that for about six years. Um, there are no jazz venues on the Sunshine Coast. So there I know, are a few. I've been looking for yes, them since I moved here. A few dedicated people that put some jazz events on, and we just right. have to do that by running a ticketed show, and that those tickets pay for the artists. But um, we, 
there's so there's a couple, the Jazz and Blues and Collective is one, which is fantastic, that Graham Buchanan runs at uh, it's at the Millwell Road Community Centre mm-hmm. and uh, I've been running a monthly event um, just because a lot of people who love to, the music and, and there's so many amazing jazz artists around and not a lot of places to play. No, and I just came so from New York City on. and I was used to the jazz there. Whenever you wanted it, you could go down to Jazz yes. at Lincoln Centre or um, down to... I'm just trying to think, what's the one? Um, 54 Below is more like cabaret style. But, yeah, there's a lot of... Um, now I can't remember the one on 50-something Street in um, Hell's Kitchen that you go down into. Ross um, might know. He's played, Birdland. played in New York. Birdland. <laughs> oh, it's probably the most famous one anyway. Whatever. It's fine. <laughs> it's my brain. Yeah, Birdland. Um, so... Uh, I know that you've brought along your band and we're, we're going to have a bit of a song here and a bit of a taste of what we can expect this weekend. Can you introduce us to the band? Or actually, why don't you blokes introduce yourself? I know you've got to come up to the microphones, but why don't you, why don't you introduce shy. yourself and say Hi. hello? Hi, I'm Peter Walters. I'm playing the bass uh, on the event on Sunday. Okay. You do sound a bit shy, Peter. <laughs> shy? No. Nah. No, just on the radio. <laughs> and, and who's over here on the keys? Um, my name is Ross Nixon. Uh, I'll be playing the... Go Anna on the, on Sunday. <laughs> They're both very humble. Ross has performed all over the world. He's performed in New York and Japan. And I might have seen you. Where else? <laughs> all over the world. Wonderful. Yes. Yeah. That's incredible. And yeah. all the way from the Sunshine Coast. So what have you brought along to sing and play for us? We're doing a song, which is a, an early blues song from a, a blues artist called Lillian Green, who was around in the late 1930s, early 1940s, but she died quite young, so we don't really remember her so much these days. She's not so famous, but she had some fantastic songs. So this song is Why Don't You Do Right from 1941. All right, we'll take it away. Mm, You had plenty money, 1922. You let other women make a fool of you. Why don't you do right? Like some of the men do Get out of here And get me some money too You're sitting there wondering what it's all about If you ain't got no money They will put you out Why don't you do right Like some of the men do Get out of here and get me some money too If you had prepared 20 years ago You wouldn't be a wandering from door to door Why don't you do right like some other men do Oh, get out of here Get me some money too driving and I took you in. Now all you got to offer is a drink of gin. Why don't you do right like some other men do? Oh, get out of here. Get me some money too. Well, you had Plenty money, 1922. You let other women make a fool of you. Why don't you do right like some other men do? Oh, get out of here and get me some money too. How beautiful is that? 
Thank you to Robin Brown and her band. And you can see them this weekend on Sunday. They'll be performing at the Jazz Blues Collective with some of those early artists, jazz, and oh, it should be a bit of fun. Um, so that's on Millwell Road, the community centre there, at 1.30 p.m. on Sunday. Um, tickets will cost you between $24 and $26. They're available online beforehand or at the door. But apparently it's only cash at the door, so make sure that you don't go just with a card. Um, speaking. 